Hello, and welcome to the Bob and Earl Show. You may be wondering why we keep making episodes, and to tell you the truth, we don't know either. But we have nothing better to do, so we're just going to keep making episodes. Unless our genius scriptwriter runs out of ideas. Shut up. And quit ad-libbing. That was in the script. Lies. That's not in the script. There is no script. Bob, I keep telling you this. That piece of paper I hand to you with all the words on it is the script. You know very well Bob doesn't read. Doesn't read or doesn't know how to read. Quiet you, or I'll be forced to unleash the wrath of the glove on you. Shut up, Shut up Bob. Bob. All right then. Yes, we get him. We get him good. You know we can hear you. Shh. No, you can't. Anyway, what was the topic of today's show? Um, good question. You don't know. You're the effing writer, for Christ's sake. How do you not know? Because we never get to the topic. All we do is fight about every little thing. I say we make up topics. About bears dressed as clowns, and they dance majestically. So, you're telling me there was never even a topic for today's episode? Originally, no. But our next episode could be about why we never topics. First of all, I don't think anyone even watches this show. Second of all, we've made three episodes about nothing. And third of all, why the hell are we still doing this? Well, we are 10,000 hits on YouTube. Really? People are hating us on YouTube? How's that possible? Are they angry at us? How can Bob hit them back? A, a thousand hits a video? More like a thousand together. Most of that was us linking out on Facebook. Oh, and visiting our own video over and over. It was mostly Bob doing that. I like the refresh button. Makes things new and fresh and spring scented. I'm seriously gonna shoot myself. But not before I shoot the both of you. Good luck with that. The glove is impervious to bullets. What the hell is this glove he keeps talking about? Don't ask. Well, if Earl wants to know more about the glove. No! The world is not ready for that. We don't want to traumatize her and the internet for life. At last, computers have evolved to allow us to hit people over the internet. How I have yearned for this feature upon seeing the cult of cute taking such a forefront of online culture. Oh, look at this fluffy cat! No, that is insipid and worthless. Why is it always a piece of work that tries to be adorable that is more popular than something profound or majestic? Makes me want to dual-wield fire-breathing chihuahuas and watch the ensuing chaos to get a more interesting reaction and some ideal of trying to look cute.